Hi, it's Thomas D here of Gasworld, and I've been joined by Morgan Morris, VP of Marketing at CO2 Meter. Thanks for joining me, Morgan. Okay. Um, first off, can you give me a, a bit of a company update, sort of how have things been over the last year? Yes, so over the last year, CO2 Meter has seen tremendous growth just in the last year with the expansion of our gas detection solutions and technology capabilities for our customers and partners worldwide. This year, we released a new industrial gas safety detector that is designed to monitor hazardous gases across really aggressive environments for our customers. They also can be implemented in applications that have severe washdown or where they're using uh, very low temperatures. So in creating this new industrial gas detector system, we've been able to gain entry into new markets and also cater to new businesses as well. Great, so that's been the, the year as a whole. Is that also your most recent development within the company? Yes, yeah, so we've also released a few new industrial gas safety resources and a brand new um, gas safety training program, which has seen huge benefits within our customers and distributors. This gas safety training program can be provided both on-site and off-site for our distributors, and it can really aid in overall accident prevention. It can help them in terms of compliance regulatory updates and also just adaptation to best gas safety practices. Um, another thing that we were extremely excited about was the launch of a new multi-gas safety system. Uh, this system can monitor across more than 40 different gases, uh, which is huge in our industry. It can really cater to a broad range of markets and really provide a solution for almost any customer across toxic combustible or refrigerant gases. This system also holds data capabilities. Uh, there's been a lot of technology advancements in the field, so being able to have this system hold these capabilities is integral for our customers and it also helps them with data transmission so that they can monitor gases wirelessly and view those measurements across any location. So a lot of exciting things at CO2 Meter. Absolutely and every year has its unique challenges so what challenges have you faced over the last 12 months and how have you overcome those too? Yes, yeah, so in terms of challenges, we feel like a lot of our customers and partners have been feeling a bit of pricing pressure um, when it comes to the increase in energy costs and just the global fluctuations in the oil and gas markets. Um, we have seen a big demand also just in terms of industrial gases um, when it comes to methane or refrigerants. Um, obviously, that demand is also going to increase price, right? So at CO2 Meter, we really try to remain vigilant and just understanding the market and understanding these updates and pricing and not just being a gas detection solution provider, but being able to offer resources where we can for our partners. Sure. So a long way of staying on top of things, what's next for, for CO2 Meter? Is there anything exciting around the corner? Yes, so funny you should ask. We actually are in the middle of planning a new full end-to-end -end service offering for our customers. Uh, we were excited to roll this out in Q1 of 2025, but the demand has been so great from our customers, we actually are rolling it out in Q4. So Gasworld is the first to hear about this news, um, of course, which is exciting. Uh, with this service offering, basically we're going to be able to provide customers not only with gas detection safety monitors, but be able to actually provide the installation, the service, annual certs for calibration and ensure that our customers can gain more compliance year over year. So it's going to really strengthen our core, not only with our existing customers, but also with new customers as well. So we're extremely excited to be able to roll this out early and we've been getting just a ton of buzz from customers on it. So we're really going to be a true one-stop shop solution now. Great, yeah, exciting times, and, and you heard it here first. Um, returning, returning to challenges with this launch, are there anything, is there anything you're anticipating over the next 12 months? Yes, so additional challenges, what we're anticipating, I would say we actually have been gaining a lot of insight to new regulatory standards, specifically in the industrial gas sector when it comes to methane and refrigerants. I think the challenge for our customers is going to be how to navigate these new regulations and updates and further how to fulfill the requirements on the compliance side. So for CO2 Meter, we really pride ourselves on not just being a gas detection solution provider, but being able to help our customers out there in understanding how to navigate these compliance requirements. We have a lot of our own personnel that are actually on board um, with other associations that really are on the forefront of these standards. So we have a little insight ahead of time and we can really help our customers in that area in understanding how to navigate those standards, even if they are new, so we can be ahead of the game. 
Sure, yes, yeah, so unique challenges. We're obviously here in Nashville at Gas World's CO2 Summit 2024. So why are events like this so important for the industry? Yes, so CO2 Meter has been a Gas World partner for over seven years now. We've been an attendee, exhibitor, advertiser, sponsor. We really value our partnership at Gas World, and we know that events like these are going to be bringing in, you know, those key global industry leaders, and we want to make sure that we're on the forefront of that. We have a lot of our partners here also at the conference, um, partners such as Tomco Systems, Chart Industries, McDantum, Hellgate Gas, just to name a few. So being able to be present at these conferences, be able to reconnect with our partners, be in the mix of all the things in terms of market trends and insights, um, also being able to view you all as a true resource. So, you know, gaining entry to some of those new updates when it comes to storage, supply, market trends, and best practices. We see a lot of value at these conferences, and we're proud to be a partner with you guys and be here. Sure, it's great to have you guys and CO2 Meter with us. Um, what are you looking forward to over the next few days we start later today so is it the connections you make is it catching up with your old partners or is it the, the event itself yeah I would say a bit of both I know for us it's really important to reconnect with those existing partners like I said there's a ton of our partners here right at the conference so being able to reconnect with them talk about market updates see how we can better aid our customers but also gain some of those new networking experiences and opportunities um, as well uh, we also are a speaker ourselves at this conference. So our executive vice president, Josh Pringle, will actually be speaking um, in session six on Thursday on innovation and technology, on CO2 technology specifically from then to now. So I myself am extremely excited to see him up there. He has just a load of expertise in the industry and be able to showcase some of our newest solutions as well. So if you're here, be sure to stay tuned to Josh on Thursday. Yeah, I'm looking forward to him presenting his, his wealth of knowledge on stage there. Yeah. Finally, I'll leave the Final words of you, Morgan, if you had a message to those watching the, the CO2 industry, what would that be? Yes, so I think definitely stay tuned to technology advancements. I think we've seen it across the board. I know I mentioned before just the database capabilities, not just that, AI integration I think is going to have a definite mix in the coming year with technology, gas detection solutions, industry advancements, and even control systems to better operate your facility in the field. If you obviously are storing or producing gas itself, obviously gas detection solutions could be a very valuable tool for you, not only to ensure safety, but also to meet code compliance and even increase your bottom line. So if you're here, definitely stay tuned and see us in booth 15. We can't wait to talk to you all. Fantastic. Well, Morgan, thank you for sitting down with me today. Yeah, thank you, Tom. It's always a pleasure.